Okay, we'll start with the Mustard R30 size 16 dry fly hook. Uh, this is a little larger than it would normally be tied. It's normally tied uh, on an 18 to a 22, the jacid. So we just attach our black tying thread and we'll go back halfway. And what we want is a hackle with a good amount of the fibres stripped off uh, at the back. So we'll just move that a bit further. There we go. Straighten up my tying thread. Tie this in. So we have a little strip stem at the back. This will just give us the opportunity of positioning the hackle when we palmer it. Now we want a peacock hurl. The original uh, uh, of this Vince Marinara row pattern was had no body material, just black tying thread. It was a very simple pattern, uh, but very effective. It lost popularity actually when Jungle Cock became more difficult to obtain. So we just go back to there and just pull that down. Um, put it up. That's what I want. So I just hold our peacock hull and we'll rotate our vise so we get a nice hull body. I need to wrap that up again a little bit. There we go. Don't want to go all the way forward to leave a little space for the jungle cut now. So we'll just lock that down and then we'll tie it off. Trim that away. And what I like to do is just put a whip finish in there, like so. Then take our hackle and just position it. And then we can palmer it. We don't want to heavily palmer this. We just want a nice open palmered hackle. front. Now, just trim that away. And I'll pop another whip finish in there. Just to secure everything. Now what a lot of uh, tires don't show you is the original trimmed off not only the top hackles but also the bottom. So what we get is just that sticking out both sides. Then what we want is jungle cock nail and this wants to extend just a bit past the body. I just hold that in position. Bring my tying thread up. I'll secure we can just position it on top. There we go. remove the surplus, take our whip finisher again, oh, 
threads gone furry there. I'll just wet it down. There we go. Give it another one. Tying thread. Got a couple of stray ones there, I'll just remove. And then we can just put a drop of varnish on there. finished jacid or yacid as it's also called great little pattern very underestimated uh, works extremely well when small beetles or anything small is on the surface really if you uh, enjoy the videos please like and subscribe and thanks for watching